My name's Larry Moore. I'm here to talk to you about my upcoming class, The Principles of Abstraction. You might be wondering, well, what do you teach in this class? How do you teach the principles of abstraction? Can they be taught? And the answer is, yes, they can. The principles that I teach are essentially principles of design. They're found in every aspect of the creative process, every form of creative expression that you can name. Interior design, graphic design, art direction, all of these things, architecture, fashion, set design, anything with the word design in it involves a set of guidelines and principles and rules. And I've whittled all of them down into seven guiding principles that will work whether you're a representational artist or you're an, a non-objective painter or somewhere in between. And your decision of how you manage those principles, well, that's up to you, even in this class. But I want you to consider this main factor. Number one is I don't teach what people generally teach. I don't teach how to paint a lemon or, or a bowl of fruit or flowers or, or the ocean. I teach how to think about what you do and how to insert yourself into your work. The students who take this class, the artists who take this class, everyone comes out of it with completely different directions, but they all utilize the same principles. You can use these to get out of hot water, no matter what you do. And it enables us to just play and try different things and bring them around. Now, how do I know any of this stuff? Well, I've been doing this for 50 years. I've been in the visual arts for 50 years. I was in graphic design for half of my life. I was an illustrator for a good portion of my life. And I've been a studio painter and a plein air painter for since 1984. How about that? A while. And I noticed, I started noticing, and I've been teaching, by the way, for 30 years. And I started noticing that no one understood creative process. And so I decided to write a book about it. Artists thought oftentimes think the creative process is the act of painting something, just the act of painting. And that isn't a creative process, that's a skill. It's what you do with the creative process. And that's what I teach. Not many people know how to teach it. So that's why I'm here. And if you're up for that challenge and you're not interested in learning how to paint another bowl of lemons, and I trust me, I love lemons and I like painting them because they're fun and they're kind of easy. But if you want to grow as an artist, this is your class. and I'm not a hard teacher. I'm a I'm a very informational, easygoing guy. I've got a book out, Fishing for Elephants, Insights and Exercises to Inspire Authentic Creativity. That's how I committed I am to what I do. I think it's important enough to write about it. I've got another book coming out as well. I don't have a title for that one yet. So join me in this class. I think you'll enjoy it.